Hi, ladies and gentlemen. I wanted to stay tuned once again to get uh, to get some exciting moves on our self-defense uh, programs. Today, we are going to work strictly on the street and how, uh, how effective way to, to free yourself from different grabs. Today, specifically, we're going to work on three grabs and two to one. How you can be be gripped by two persons and uh, free yourself from them. So first timers, please always feel free to subscribe and hit the bell. Okay, now back to the field. These are two men. As, as simple as it can be. They grab and you are finding a way to free yourself. And they grab, grab as hard as possible as you can. Make it so rough. All right. Now they are dragging you left, right, and that. Now, what do you do? How can you free yourself? Like I always say, when you are in a self-defense, you have to be relaxed. You don't need to be in tension for whatever reason. So what you do is the first thing: you step forward. When you step forward, as you're dragging, step forward, and then you go. Please. Okay. All right. Now we we'll take the grab again. From there, you move one and two. All right. Now from here, you can still hold them back and see. take that to free yourself. To be very very sure that you free yourself from them. Take the grab again. On that same note, said you step forward. Take your hand back and this. Then you still hold them back and take that and take that. Okay, that's number one. Now let's make it slow so that everybody can have a good view and understand. This grab is as hard as you struggle to free yourself, you struggle to free yourself, no way. Now what do you do? step forward and this goes back strike pull them back as simple as that then you hold you might free them or you decide to hold and then finish with that and finish with that simple as that okay now let's take the second still same grab for the second way to free now lock it up again from here the other one, the first one was step and you go. But this time, you step here and you go. Now from here, you clamp them together. And sit down. All right. Let's take that again. The lock here. You go one. Two. Look at where the hand goes. Step here. The, the front and back movement is, is important to destabilize them, to make them confused. Because when you go one and you go, you have succeeded to destabilize them. Even their brains also will be destabilized. So you go one and lock here. The, this lock here goes to the strike. One. And clamp together. And free here and strike here down. As simple as that. Anybody can do it. All you need to do is just to know the principles and okay. follow it up. Okay, let's take it for the last time. Now lock again. Okay, <laughs> let's try to make it as slow and as simplified as possible. Try to free yourself. Drag. And you go one and two and you take a strike here and the strike here takes you clamp them together now from here three here and all right at least we've been able to do how many moves that should be two two moves now let's take one more move. Grab. 
All right. Now, we can as well decide to go this way. This make them very hard. Make the graph very hard. We can decide to go this way. Get that grab again. Let me make it very simple and easy. Struggle and struggle and struggle, and I sink down with four. You get this now. I succeeded to bring the two of them together. Now I can do whatever I want to do with them here. Okay, all right. Waistline grab. Now let's go to the double hand grab. All right. Now this, the same way goes. The same principles is applied here. Step forward. Grab very hard. The rope. You're dragging me. Okay. Now I try to stabilize myself. Try to stabilize myself, and the next thing, pull together. See, from here, I can decide to do anything from here either i free myself here and strike here and strike here that's one take that again come back wrap i struggle to move throw in good i free myself here strike here and strike here one and two that's one <laughs> let's take that for the third time Please. To be, be uh, to be as simplified as possible for everybody to understand. I go one, I freak one and two here. Then the second part of this, grab again, <coughs> lock as hard as possible. You drag, drag and drag. And what I do is I send forward and I do this on the hand. Ah. What's happening now? <laughs> okay. All right, we take that again. Ready? You drag and drag and drag. I go one. I turn the hand. Can we feel this? Okay. All right. Now, slowly now. Slowly, the grab comes. I try to struggle myself and free. There's no way. I pull one and I turn here. See this? <laughs> you feel it? <laughs> All right. Now let's go to the third move of that same grab. Now ready, we go slowly, from here, go one, this time I lock here, come back, come back, come back, I go sink in, good, <laughs> now from here, I lock the hands, here, and what happens? <laughs> We get that. Let's take it again. Grab. I sink. One. Ha. Here. Lock and. This one, I know. This one, I know. This one, So, if you follow the principle, it has simple and as easy as anything but if you do not know the principle then you will find it very difficult so let's just take it once grab again i make it slow again maybe much slower i go one and from here i turn and I <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
As simple as you see it may not be that simple except you know the principles. So once you know the principles, be sure it is as simple as it is. So please, you do subscribe and hit the bell. Please subscribe. Don't fail to subscribe. Subscribe and hit the bell. Thank, Thank you. you.